Hi all, um, I'm gonna go over how to do your holiday rhythm matchup. So you received this video along with a link to this worksheet and all you really need to do to start is type your name in that text box. So there should already be a text box here. You're going to type your name in it. For me, obviously I'm gonna write Miss McGinnis because that's my name. You're going to put your name here. If you need to zoom in at all, use the little zoom feature. Um, I can't see those well so I'm going to go ahead and zoom in. Unclick it so you're not zooming anymore. Now you have a list of words here and beneath that you have these different rhythm options. So in the first box we have ta ta. In the second box we have ta ti ti. In this next box we have ti ti ta and in the final box we have ti 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 ti. We are looking to fit these words on this list with the rhythms below. In order to do this, it really helps to know how many syllables are in the words. So if we look at our rhythms really quickly, ta, 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 ta has how many sounds? That's right, two. Let's look at our next one, ta, ti, ti. So that's ta, ti, ti. That is how many sounds? Three. Our next box is ti, ti, ta. Ti, ti, ta. You may notice this one also has three sounds. Our next one, ti, 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 has ti, 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 four sounds. So when we're looking at our words, the sounds match up with syllables. So let's look at our first word and do it together. We have cookies. Cookies. How many syllables does cookies have? Two. Which one of our boxes represents two sounds? If you're looking at this ta ta box, you would be right. So I'm going to click on that box and I can write cookies. Then I'll just go ahead and hit the enter button to go down to the next line. So cookies is now done. We're going to skip around a little bit because I want to do some ones that aren't all the same. So let's look at Santa's sleigh. So I'm skipping over dreidel right now. You'll want to do that one, but we're going to look at Santa's sleigh. So first off, let's figure out how many syllables is in Santa's sleigh. Santa's sleigh. Okay, so we have three syllables. That means we have two different options. We have ta ti ti or ti ti ta. So let's look at ta ti ti first for Santa's sleigh. That would be Santa's sleigh. Does that sound right? Santa's sleigh. Doesn't sound right to me, does it? So let's look at ti ti ta now. Santa's sleigh. Ti ti ta. Santa's sleigh. That fits. So we will click here. There's a text box already there for you and we'll type in Santa's sleigh. So when it comes to the ones with three syllables, you want to try both. Whichever one sounds correct, it's going to be the right one. So say it both ways, see which one works better. All right, let's see. We'll do another one together. We'll go for wrapped presents. That's our next one here. So wrapped presents. So first off, how many syllables? Wrapped presents. Wrapped presents. So when we do that one, we notice we have three syllables, which means we're in one of these two boxes again. So let's see here. We have ta ti ti, which would be wrapped presents. Does that sound right? It should, because it is. So under ta ti ti, we're going to put wrapped presents. Now, I'm going to leave the rest of these for you to finish on your own. This should take you no longer than 10 minutes. Uh, if you're struggling, let us know. We're here to help. We can meet with you one-on-one -on -one and work on it some more. Uh, good luck finishing this one up. Bye, guys.